renegotiating of the protocol is unrealistic. No workable alternative solution has been found to this delicate, long negotiated balance. Any renegotiations would simply bring further legal uncertainty for the people and businesses in Northern Ireland. For these reasons, the European Union will not renegotiate the protocol. It is with significant concern that we take note of today's decision by the UK government to table legislation disapplying core elements of the protocol. Unilateral action is damaging to mutual trust. The Commission will now assess the UK draft legislation. In particular, the protocol provides business operators in Northern Ireland with access to the EU single market for goods. The UK government's approach puts this access and related opportunities at risk. Our aim will always be to secure the implementation of the protocol. Our reaction to unilateral action by the UK will reflect that aim and will be proportionate. As a first step, the Commission will consider continuing the infringement procedure launched against the UK government in March 2021. We had put this legal action on hold in September 2021 in spirit of constructive cooperation to create the space to look for joint solutions. The UK's unilateral action goes directly against this spirit. The Commission will also consider launching new infringement procedures that protect uh, the EU single market from risks that the violation of the protocol creates for the EU businesses and for the health and safety of EU citizens. Today's decision by the UK government undermines the trust that is necessary for bilateral EU-UK cooperation within the framework of the Trade and Cooperation Agreement. We call on UK government to engage with us on joint solutions. The Commission stands ready to play its part as it has from the outset.